Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com here. We are doing 2017 Panini Donruss Elite Football. This is a 12 box. It's a full case right here. It's going to take about an hour long. Full case. Pick your team break number two from jazbeeshobbyland.com. A big thank you to these folks right here who dug deep, who made it happen here on the 15th. Let me adjust the uh, focus a little bit. So thanks to everybody who got in on a Saturday. Thanks for joining us. Now, if you see one of those little uh, rooftops next to your name, that means you got that team in a spot randomizer. So Ziggy and Alex saving themselves a little bit of money there in that spot randomizer, getting those two teams. Allen with the last spot mojo getting the Titans. Now, I had a – the teams, we were, we were down to the last six teams. The break kind of stalled out a little bit. Uh, in terms of selling that this break out, so I added a little bit of uh, a little incentive, a little promo. I said that the last, the the last six teams remaining, whoever bought them, we're gonna get a chance at these. We got these uh, eight by ten autograph photos from the NFLPA rookie premiere, thanks to Panini and GTS, uh, Patrick Mahomes, Dalvin Cook, where he actually signs most of his name, Davis Webb, John Ross, a Panini gym bag, and a Panini snapback cap. Let me show these off really quick. So here were the 8x10 photos that were given away. There's Patrick Mahomes right here. There's Dalvin Cook actually signing most of his name, 8x10. These were signed at the event that we that Jaspies uh, were at. It was a good time. There's John Ross, the speedy John Ross, and Davis Webb, Silver Ink autograph right there. So that's, those are the photos that we're randomizing to those last six people that bought spots, a Panini snapback cap. And this nice, uh, nice Panini sack pack, nice gym bag right here. A couple of zipper on the front, zipper on the bottom back, pretty solid stuff. Good for you, good for the kids, good for everyone. So here were the last, uh, so here are the prizes right here. We're gonna randomize them. So it was just kind of a random thing. And here are the last six people. So thanks to Alan, Kevin, Justin, Adam, Brendan, and Alan for uh, buying the last six teams in this break. Let's randomize them three times. So names first, one, two, and three. These are just extra little bonus prizes. So thanks, guys, for filling these up quickly. I appreciate it. Let's paste the names in here. And then once again, two and a one, three times for the prizes. One, two, and three. So before the break even starts, everybody is a winner. So Alan, you're gonna be sent the Panini snapback cap. Adam Kupram, you got the Dalvin Cook eight by 10 autograph photo with him actually signing most of his name. Brendan, you got the Davis Webb 8x10 autograph photo. Kevin, with the Patrick Mahomes 8x10 autograph photo. Alan, you got the John Ross 8x10 photo. And J-Mac, little gym bag for you, there you go. So those are the bonus prizes, thank you very much. And now we can go on to the break. I showed the team list already, did I? I think I did, yeah, but there it is again, on a Saturday. The 15th, there you go. Big case right here. So get comfortable, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to take a little bit. J Mac, who has the Chargers, saying, hey, maybe I can fill that gym bag with Chargers hits. I hope so too. I'll just fill it. I'll just fill it up. I'll just top load all the hits and I'll just throw them in there and we'll just mail it like that. We wouldn't mail it like that, but. All right. The thought is nice, filling up that entire gym bag with hits. Oh, there's a lone box back here. There it is. All right. So as you can see right here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Pull these boxes up front. These two boxes, what we'll do first. Okay, so uh, it's been a little bit since we've done this. So Vince saying, did Bellinger really hit for the cycle? Nice. Good job, Cody. 
five cards per pack, 20 packs per box. We're looking for two autographs, including one on-card pen pal autograph in here per box on average. I guess there's memorabilia cards in there too. Excellent. There you go. So settle in folks, kick back, relax. This is pick your team number two. All the players in their current uniforms, mostly. All the rookies with their pro uniforms, I think, or logos, logos at least attached to them. That's easy. Oh yeah, I remember this now. The, the part that takes the longest is actually the... <laughs> the packaging is a little weird. Well, yeah, I'm waiting for someone else to confirm that. But, oh, no, Vince and Evan saying we got a confirmation. Yeah, we got a second on that motion that Cody Bellinger hit for the cycle. What was, how to, what was the order of the cycle? That's pretty awesome. I don't see Aaron Judge hitting for the cycle. All Aaron Judge can do is hit 400, like 500-foot home runs. All Aaron Judge can do. All right, almost done opening up this first box. Oh, the triple was the last one. Wow. J Mac saying that the order of Cody Bellinger's cycle was single, homer, double, and then triple. I feel like the triple is the hardest one, right? Like you almost have to luck into a triple and then look at look at maybe doing the cycle. Wow. All right, well, congrats to Cody Bellinger. All right, well, congrats to the first person to get hits out of here and every person that gets hits out of here. There's James Conner, 14 out of 25 for the Steelers. I, I kind of love these cards right here. The uh, <laughs> These spellbound cards, you can collect all the letters in here. I think that would be that would make for a pretty sick set. You know, you spell out the guy's name out of 299, New York Football Giants. That will go to Victor. No, sorry. That goes to David. So I think vet base does not ship in this. Correct. No vet base ships, but obviously all these numbered cards, numbered cards and other inserts will most certainly ship obviously. 12 out of 24, Allen Robinson die cut. And there's our first autograph. James Conner, there he is, 9 out of 99. Turn of the century autograph. Kind of the that checkerboard X-Fractor kind of background there. For the Steelers, James Allen with the Steelers. So we'll set this right here so we can keep track of what autographs we got. All of these numbered cards right here, I'll sleeve up and top load uh, at the end of the break, just to save ourselves a little bit of time. This break's going to be long enough. 40 out of 87, Sterling Shepard, New York Football Giants, David Pugh. Blake Bortles, 49 out of 95, Jaguars. That will go to um, David, Riley Card Collector. What's this here? Oh, I'm going to mix it up and do it this way, huh? Jamal Adams, there's your relic, Joe Thomas. 87 out of 99. Standouts, Pro Bowl standouts. 
Nice Pro Bowl relic for the Cleveland Browns. Greg Branchick with that one. Ed Reed. So like refractors or inserts like this will definitely ship. Rookie cards like this will definitely ship out of four ninety nine for the Browns. Stuff like this will ship. There's David and Yoku again. Out of ninety nine this time. Greg and the Browns. Flip this around here. Another spellbound. So <laughs> Giants, David, you're on your way. Although you'd have to match the numbers too, right? So the design would be the same, but anyhow, that's a fun chase in Elite, I think. Field vision. Oh yeah, we'll randomize these left and right. So whatever left side or the right side will get them. If they're numbered, then we'll uh, randomize them separately. Out of 25, Brian Urlacher for the Bears, Ziggy. Derek Carr to 99 for my Raiders. That will be Ziggy as well. And there's your Pen Pals autograph, CJ Bethard. Nice on-card auto. I believe the different colored ink will let you know how short printed it is. I don't know what the what the different short prints are, but I think like green and red may be train whistle type short prints on those. All right, nice. And a few of these guys to close it out. There's D.D. Westbrook to 499. Excellent. Let me slide these over. And let's go to the next box. Good luck. Good this guy. Good this guy. That guy, everybody. How are we feeling about the football season, everybody? Talk to me here. Let me know what your team is, and let me know what you expect from them this season. You feel better about them this season after all the offseason moves? Worse? I'm a Raiders fan, as most of you know. I think uh, as long as the Raiders are healthy and, and shore up that you know, keep continue to shore up that defense. I think the Raiders will be great. Offensively, I think the Raiders are going to be fine. Um, you know, Derek Carr will be healthy, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But uh, while while the Raiders have good individuals on defense, they need to play better, uh, better team defense. I think just overall, just putting together all four quarters, you know, kind of thing. So that's what I think. Uh, Casey, no, this this is the second box. You only missed one box. The first two autographs were C.J. Bethard for the Niners and uh, James Conner for the Steelers. So John Okre is saying Super Bowl or bust for the Packers. Yeah, I guess the Aaron Rodgers, he's saying Aaron Rodgers needs at least one more title. Yeah, the Aaron, the window, I mean, he's not that, you know, his, his career's not over anytime soon, but, you know, he's not exactly... Uh, a spring chicken anymore. But adding another Super Bowl title would be pretty good for uh, for the Aaron Rodgers legacy. Brad says, Bradley Gould says Raiders because of Marshawn. Scott DeRose is saying, realistically, hey, the Pats need to make the Super Bowl. It's a disappointment. That's the kind of bar that they have set for sure. All right, second box. It's Marvin Jones Jr., 99 for the Lions. Uh, that'll be for Joe Kroll. Trying to move a little bit more quickly here. D'Angelo Yancey out of 499 uh, for the Packers. Speaking of the Packers, there's Jalen Ramsey out of 149 for the Jaguars. There's Matt Stafford to 149. Jameis Winston. There's uh, Yeah, there's Stafford out of 25. Nice. 13 out of 25 for Joe Kroll and the Lions. 
Speaking of Aaron Rodgers, there he is, spellbound for the Packers, 20 out of 99. That's for Adam Kupperman. There's Rodgers again. You're almost there, Adam. Out of 299. You've got the D now. There's Dak Prescott. That is out of 15. Nice. 13 out of 15. Nice low number for the Cowboys. That goes to Joe Kroll. And nice. Both Jaguars. Leonard Fournette, D.D. Westbrook. Green ink, dual auto right on the card. I think that's a... Can someone confirm that for me? Are the green ink autos like... How short printed are they? Like out of five? One of one, maybe? That that dual autos for the Jaguars. Riley card collector, Dave, with that one. Oh, there's Marlon Humphrey out of 499. J Max, a Seahawks fan. He's like, hey, they just need an O-line. And then what? Anything could happen, right? Still a pretty exciting team. There's the other autograph. Marlon Mack, 77 out of 99 for the uh, Colts. That's for Casey. So Casey on the board early. To Marcus Walker to 499. Wayne Gallman for the Giants out of, uh, what is that, out of 70. Ezekiel Elliott, elite coverage, dual relic for the Cowboys. It's another one for Joe Kroll. Charles Harris to 99. Well, Dave, I'm not sure if this is a train whistle or not, these green ink autographs. But that this is pretty strong. Both Leonard Fournette and D.D. Westbrook. If it turns out that I owe you one, we'll make up for it. Nice. All right. Let's keep chugging along. My class says the, that the Browns are winning the Super Bowl. If the Browns win the Super Bowl, if the Browns... Is that possible? That's like that's like the that that English Premier League team. You remember that last year, uh, Leicester City, who had like five thousand to one odds or something like that in England, and they won the title. Like that, the Browns winning the title would be kind of like that. The Browns won the title. I mean, that means you're talking about catastrophic injuries for the rest of the AFC North. Like Joe Flacco loses a leg, and like. Big Ben loses an arm and Andy Dalton like, you know, loses an elbow or something like that. And and like that's what would have to happen. And then from there the, the Browns would have to manage to win games, <laughs> you know, in spite of all of that, win the division and then I suppose I mean, I guess anything could happen in the playoffs, right? Something goofy could happen in the playoffs and then you just go from there. I suppose <laughs> Adam Kupferman, Jets fan Adam Kupferman is just like, hey, what about a Browns-Jets AFC championship game? Oh, man. You know, believe it or not, I mean, the Jets are not that far removed from, from you know, from, the, from a nice run in the playoff. Browns-Jets? I don't know if the NFL ratings would want that, Adam Kupperman, no offense. But I guess, I mean, if they got that far, that'd be pretty exciting. That means one of those guys would have beaten the Patriots, right? And the Raiders. Now the world would just be topsy-turvy at that point. It's like 2017-18 where weird happened. And, like, the Brooklyn Nets and the Lakers are in the NBA Finals next year.
Tampa Bay Rays win the World Series? Just everything turned all upside down. Okay. There's LaShawn McCoy, 94 out of 99. Dion Lewis to 67. These college ties cards, yeah, these will be randomized left or right. DeMarco Murray to 29 for the Titans. Is sound cutting out for anybody else? Bradley is apparently experiencing some sound. If that's the, if that's the, uh, if no one else is experiencing that, then it's on your end, Bradley. Jameis Winston Pro Bowl Relic. It's a nice one for the Buccaneers. That would be for Kyle Fenema. Thanks, Paul T. Paul T. said he went to both Panini's website and Cardboard Connection, but could not find any any uh, car, uh, quantity number for green ink autographs. All right, fair enough. Bradley was also asking who my top five football teams are. Like right now, out of four ninety nine, Tankersley. Uh, T. J. Watt out of four ninety nine. Le'Veon Bell to 99. And 34 out of 99. Face-to-face, -face, Des Bryant, Josh Norman. So this will be a randomizer. Yeah, okay, so if it's fine, yeah, probably something on your end, Brad. Sometimes if you, maybe you can refresh the page or the app, that always helps. We got Samaj P. Ryan out of Elite. Ziggy with the Redskins. Nice on-card auto. Not sure what's next on the menu. This is going to take a minute or two. And nothing was really close to filling, but maybe Gold Standard 8, uh, I think, was pretty close to single digits. Spellbound to 299 for the Packers. Um, I think we're going to try to accomplish Flawless. Nice passing the torch. 12 out of 20 Derek Henry autograph. For Alan Murdoch, last spot mojo. 12 out of 20 on that autograph. There's tidal waves, Aaron Rodgers. Oh, that's not numbered. I thought it would be. Never mind. Kind of hard to see the serial number sometimes. Alshon Jeffrey, 5 out of 17. And Carl Lawson, 258. Um. I don't know what my top five teams would be, Bradley, by the way. Uh, Smitty had answered your question a second ago. Oh, sorry. Let me scroll up a little bit. Smitty says uh, Raiders, Patriots, Falcons, Packers, and Titans. Sounds pretty good to me. And I did not hear about those Megatron... Uh, did not hear about those uh, Megatron rumors... Smitty, is there any credence to that? Are we just getting all those guys out of retirement? I wouldn't mind though. Malachi Dupree to 499. Kirk Cousins on the back right there. All right, so nice. Slide these over. Like I said, I'll, I'll top load, sleeve and top load all of those numbered cards after the break. It's just in the interest of time. Autographs will top load immediately. Sleeve and top load immediately. As for uh, Connor, Connor McDavid and Mayweather, I, I personally don't think that... that uh, I almost said Connor McDavid. Connor McGregor, I think Connor McGregor doesn't have a chance. I think he's going to get destroyed by Floyd May Mayweather. It's the same way that I think that if, if Mayweather stepped into the octagon, that he would be destroyed. You know, like, and people, people think that crossover is going to be so easy, but, you know, you have to realize that McGregor can't just throw Mayweather to the ground. <laughs> can't kick him. It's, it's just literally just boxing, just street fighting, you know, so... Mayweather 
no matter what you think of him personally, boxing wise, he's an extremely frustrating boxer because very patient, very technical, very defensive, you know, and so, uh, it, I mean, he's frustrated some of the best boxers out there and has, and has won. So I think we're going to see more, more of the same from Mayweather. I think anybody who thinks, I mean, I, who knows? I mean, you know, if McGregor lands a lucky punch, you know, with those heavier gloves, if he lands a luckier punch, I mean, anything could happen, right? But on paper, it's just hard to see McGregor standing a chance. Oh, uh, Smitty with a with some good uh, with some good boxing conspiracy, which is not a not they would do something like that, right? Smitty's saying he he thinks that McGregor will Connor will win some rounds, but ends up DQing himself, so they would have to do a rematch. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past them, right? Larry Fitzgerald Pro Bowl stands out. That's for the Arizona Cardinals. Tyler Kish on the board. And you, uh, oh, UCLA Superfan. I was, I was like, you claw. UCLA Superfan says on eBay, the green ink dual autos are just listed as short prints, no numbers. All right, so we got a, a second on that. I think those are not numbered. That's nice. That's a nice Jay Ajaye to 15. Nice low number there. That's what I love about this set. There's like a lot of low numbered parallels that you can snag. There's Tom Brady. Out of 24, Aaron Jones die cut for the Packers. Dee Dee Westbrook to 4.99, And LaShawn McCoy to 149 And nice. Ricky Jackson, Impact Impressions autograph. 17 out of 49. Nice. For the Saints, that goes to Victor, who got the Saints in a spot randomizer. So spot random mojo. Love it. Joe Mixon to 149. Tidal Waves. And your pen pal autograph, Cooper Cup. Nice on-card autograph for the Los Angeles Rams, James Allen. Nice one, James. Carl Lawson to 99 for the Bengals. And the last bits, just looking for parallels. Got family ties, 141 out of 299. That'll be a randomizer. Odell Beckham H, 10 out of 99. Jeremy McNichols to 499. Marcus Walker to 499 Broncos face to face that is numbered I, think the, I don't think these college ones are numbered and Dion Lewis to 149 nice Patriots with that one All right, next box. Smitty's like, hey, listen, <laughs> I swore I wasn't going to pay for this fight. But I think that's what's going to happen to a lot of people. I think, I think, I think leading up to it, everyone's just going to be like, this is, this is a big money grab. This is, this is a big money grab. They're, you know, they don't hate each other as much as they say. They're just toying with the press. They're just making out with a huge payday. You know, there's no way I'm going to pay like, what is it, like over a hundred bucks for the fight just to see, you know, a bad fight, blah, 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 blah. And, but yet I'll bet a lot of us, perhaps myself included, <laughs> you know, may, may participate in, in, in purchasing that fight along with a group of friends. <laughs> like, I think that might happen.
Yeah, we pay for the fight and just to watch Connor get DQ'd. <laughs> Smitty also saying, hey, I swear, if the Raiders win it all, you're going to cry like a baby. You know what's going to happen. The crying part. <laughs> um, I think I might... I might too. I think, like, I'm trying to think. If the Dodgers won the World Series, the Dodgers haven't won a World Series in a very long time, almost as long as the Raiders have won a Super Bowl. Um, but I think the Dodgers have always... I, th I mean, I like baseball more, and I think it would, m it would maybe mean more for me for the Dodgers to win the World Series. However, I think the Raiders have just... But the, the, the Dodgers have still been decent, you know what I mean, um, for the last X amount of decades. You know, they've made NLCSs, you know, they've, they've had good teams, you know. But the Raiders have just been heart-achingly, heart-breakingly bad, you know. And I think I, think I, I may be, yeah, I may be more, I may be pretty emotional about a Raiders Super Bowl win. Yeah, Bellinger does have a great swing. Yeah, Michael. How well? Connor, uh, Connor is getting, um, is getting a hundred million dollars, but like Floyd is getting like two hundred million dollars. Uh, Matt, no worries. Um, no, ten buck breaks is uh, just Monday through Friday, so they are, they have not been on at all today. Pen pals, Mac Hollins. I will not be doing hockey today. That's also back on Monday. Uh, Pen pals autograph for the Eagles, Joe Kroll and DeAndre Hopkins at a one forty nine. Set that there. Let's sleeve this one up. Yep, just me today. Sorry to disappoint, Sam and Matt. Oh, just Joe? I guess. Miles Garrett to 99 for the Browns. Home field advantage. Uh, Antonio Brown, O oh, to 25. Nice. Family Ties, 299. Elijah Hood for the Raiders out of 149. And there's our other autograph, another Titan. Tawan Taylor, 19 out of 149. Another one for Alan Murdoch and the Last Bot Mojo. Jamal Williams out of 149. And there's our relic. Tony Dorsett, Pro Bowl standouts for the Cowboys. And that goes to Joe Kroll with the boys. Big Ben at a 24 die cut for the Steelers. Warren Sapp, thought that might have been numbered, it's not. Malik McDowell to 499, Seahawks. Brandon Cooks to 99 for the Patriots. Jamal Williams again, 499. Fired up. Aaron, look at Aaron Rodgers is fired up there. That's out of 299 for the Packers. There he is again. Spellbound. That's the G in Rodgers. 62 out of 99. And there's Robert Davis to 499 for the Redskins. Ziggy with the Redskins. Next box. What up, the card? Those are your hits there. Next box. We're chugging along. We're motoring along. Just fine. Yeah, Michael House, we were just talking that boxing, yeah, it's, it's an insane amount of money. <laughs> uh, and it's really, it's, it's a lot of us paying for, <laughs> paying for most of it. And there's another big match after that too, right? I think... Canelo and Triple G, I believe the Russian, are boxing, are, are fighting each other in a few weeks after that.
that should actually be a proper boxing match. And a lot cheaper too, I think. Nice, Nick LaPlante saying he got his Steiner, Jaspi memorabilia, Tyson and Holyfield. It's pretty sick. Speaking of boxing. Nice, Nick. Was that already framed? I don't think it was, right? You gotta frame, you gotta keep that, right? If I got something like that, I don't, I mean, that's such a part of like, like sports, like sports pop culture history, right? That moment, you know? Where just Mike Tyson just loses it, but just have both of their autographs there. Think about it. Both of them saw the picture and said, yeah, we'll, we'll sign it. <laughs> you know, so they, so you know there were good sports about it, about signing something like that. So, yeah, I think I think that's that's one that's one of those things. Like if you got like a really nice Steiner Jaspi photo of maybe a player that you of something that's really nice and valuable but perhaps a player you didn't don't like or don't need to hang up I'd sell it but for something like that 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 Tyson Holyfield that that moment is just a moment just getting his ear chomped on nommed on you know it's such a big moment it's hard not to just frame and put it in your office or game room or whatever man cave I mean and be like it'd be such a conversation piece it'd be like oh my god is that that moment and be like yeah Wait, those are the autographs of both of those five? Yeah, they are. Such a cool story. Yeah, an iconic moment, exactly. Josh Reynolds for the Rams. He's looking forward to some iconic moments this season for Los Angeles. James Allen with that one. Couple Rams already. Ben Rothsberger to 149. We got Trayvon Durrell. To, looks like to 86. I can't even read that. Yeah, 86 for the Saints. It's just the reflection in my eyes. Uh, Clay Matthews is fired up. Look at that. Out of 299. There is your relic, Larry Fitzgerald. Pro Bowl standouts. That goes to the Cardinals. That goes to Tyler. Tyler Kish with the Larry Fitzgerald. Mike Williams. And there's our other autograph. That's Jay Ajaye passing the torch autograph. 48 out of 99. Jay Ajaye had a nice second year. That's the thing. You have to think about all the first-year players that seem to disappoint in football. And then in the second year, they start to come through. There could be a lot of players like that this year. Zay Jones to 99. Joe Green, Jabril Peppers to 499. OJ Howard for the Buccaneers to 99. Ardarius Stewart for the Jets for 49 to 499. Collegiate ties, those aren't numbered. Ty Montgomery to 88. That's for the Packers. We've got Brian Hill to 99, to 38, I'm sorry, for the Dirty Birds. Odell Beckham Jr. got the H. Have we made all the letters yet? Five out of 99. I should have been spreading those out there. And Carl Lawson to 499 for the Bengals. That should have been the game we should be playing to see if we could spell out any of those players. All right, good luck, everybody. If you want to try to get one of those big, awesome bits of memorabilia that Nick LaPlante got, that what we're talking about, those Steiner memorabilia breaks, we have one on um, we have one on uh, on JaspiesHobbyland.com right now. If you join the three box playbook break, 2015 playbook football break, a three box random team break. If you join that, we're giving away a Steiner Jaspies memorabilia box. We only have a handful of those left, not too many left. So get it going. Oh, I like that. We'll 
beautiful. That 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 was certainly make me cry too. Smitty Smitty saying, Kenny Stabler called his dad on the phone before cancer took who before cancer took his life. Make a long story short, Raiders win it. Smitty cries, gets a new tattoo, sails off in the sunset, breaking on Jaspies. I love it. Now that would definitely be a moment. I think it's going to affect a lot of people, especially if they can win one before they before they leave Oakland. They've got two years. It's possible. Kevin Crouch is saying either him or um, Aaron Rodgers. We should be pretty close to spelling their names, right? I kind of want to. This will make the break a little bit longer, but should we kind of? We should. I'm kind of curious now, right? This is what really takes the break a long time. This this is what adds the minutes. Are we curious? Do we kind of want to look? We should kind of look, right? Now I'm curious. Damn it. It's going to take up way too much time, but kind of have to. We don't have we don't have a break filled up anyway, so who cares? <laughs> we don't have a break filled up anyway. We're pretty close on Rodgers, I think. It's going to be a while for the for the Beckham, I believe. But these need to be sleeved anyway. R. Oh, well, we actually kind of need an O, another R, I think, right? And an S. Pretty close on this. All right, Antonio Brown, Odell Beckham, we, we may not be that close for you. Sorry. But Rodgers, pretty close on the Rodgers. Who has the Packers? Adam Kupperman, we're pretty close here. We're making the set for you right now. <laughs> Pen Pals, James Conner. Is that our second one, Pen Pal, James Conner? It's our second James Conner. I don't know if the second James, second Pen Pal, James Conner, but that will go to... Steelers, James Allen with a James Connor. Set that with the other Antonio Brown. Family ties out of 49. Chad Hansen to 499. Deonta Foreman to 27. And there's our other autograph. And it's our Joshua Dobbs, 10 out of 49 Steelers, doing very well in this break so far. Tidal Waves, Michael Thomas, and Kevin King to 99. Kevin King again, 499. Samaj P. Ryan to 499. It's my boy Amari Cooper to 99. And elite coverage. Derrick Henry for the Titans. That goes to Alan Murdoch. Two color dual relic. What up, monster? TJ Watt to 10 for the Steelers. Ezekiel Elliott's fired up. That's two two ninety nine. There it is. College ties and Sam Bradford to ninety nine. 
All right, so we're close here. We're almost there. So stay tuned. Didn't you ask this question the other day, Monster? Maybe hammer time. Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. Doom, 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 doom. Well, Top Star stopped making uh, football in 2015. So you got to be a little more specific too. Like what year are you talking about football? Only Panini makes football for the time being. So when you say which NFL teams have the best hits and tops, are you talking about 1982 tops? 1995? 2014. All you have to do, my friend, is just to look at the NFL draft classes and just see who the best players are from those drafts that are, were in the first round, and that'll give you a good idea of of uh, that'll give you an idea of the teams of the best teams for any draft class for any year. Oh, you meant this year. Well, that's hard to tell. A lot of these uh, rookies currently have not even played a game. So that makes it difficult to tell which one, like the big teams are. We're not really going to know who the big team's going to be until a little bit into the season. However, as of now, these players are just kind of going based off of uh, the best, the quote unquote best teams are really just going based off of who has, you know, the most upside rookies, I guess, on there. Rookies that were popular in college. That kind of thing. Okay, here we go. Next box. Yeah, if anybody else has any thoughts on that, feel free to chime in as I go through this box. Le'Veon Bell to 99. Cooper Cup to 499. Rams. College ties. Those aren't numbered, so I'm just breezing by those. Those will be... Uh, left right randomizer at the end. There's a Sean Watson to 499. That's one of the bigger teams out there. Fired up, Drew Brees, 42 out of 99 for the Saints. Fired up, Warren Sapp to 299. Bucks. Those are not numbered. Feed the Crow out of 499 or 149. That'll go to the Browns. There's Malik Hooker for the Colts out of 99. There's your Pen Pals autograph. That's Mitch Trubisky. Nice. That's one of the big ones too. Quarterback position, popular team, historically popular team, high round draft pick. That's what makes that's what makes kind of like a a team quote unquote the best. Mitch Trubisky, that goes to Ziggy, who got this spot, who got the bear spot in a spot randomizer. Getting that spot random mojo. Nice. Oh, great. Yeah, he pops in every once in a while, monster, but you're not really supposed to promote other people's channels in my room. So don't do that. Or else it'll be hammer time. Doom, 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 hammer time. Doom, 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 doom. Solomon Thomas. Niners, hammer time, doom, doom. Oh, maybe we'll finish Bell right here. 299, we have, oh no, Brown, I mean. we have Brown, but not Bell. That's our first Bell. And there's our other autograph right here. Five out of 49, Matthew Days. There's Jordan Howard, 78. And there's Tony Dorsett, 77 out of 99, Pro Bowl standouts. 
We're getting close, TJ. Uh, that will go to Joe Kroll. Jay to 99 Monster, whose brother is the, the hobby pack or whatever, um, is asking, how do some NFL rookies have rookie relic cards? Well, how do you think? Yeah, usually most of them are just event worn. So it'll be the NFL PA rookie premiere and they'll they'll do that to get some of the earlier uh, relics out there. And then obviously when the season starts, that's when they can get start getting game used relics. But they get their jerseys beforehand. They put them on, they wear them, they do an event, they walk around a little bit, they take pictures in them. And then Panini takes them and yeah, and then cuts them up, puts them into these different sets that we're seeing. So they do the NFL PA rookie premiere here in Los Angeles. At least for recently they've done it. We've been, we've actually gone the last few years. So they'll do it in Los Angeles. And Panini and then the NFL PA, the Players Association all get together for uh, that whole week of events. And there you go. <laughs> You're right. When it becomes too much of a hassle. And Kevin Crouch looking for Matty Ice. I know, we're already at the last four box. It wasn't so bad, right? This is a breeze when we're just hanging out. Chit-chatting. I don't even know what I'm watching on TV anymore. There was this the soccer. U.S. beat Nicaragua today in the in a Gold Cup matchup. I think something in group stages. I have no idea what's on there right now. If someone can invent a pack opening machine, you could charge a premium to a lot of people for that. Just put it in a just put put it in a machine and it goes and just spits it out and be like, cool. Or or a top loader dispenser. If someone could find me a top loader dispenser, um, that would be awesome. I would love a top loader dispenser that works like a Pez dispenser. So every time I slide a top loader out here, it like a almost like a magazine in a gun. I want it to feed another top loader out. <laughs> That's what I want it to do. So like, so how, how I do this right now is that I have these stack of top loaders next to me and I just, I just have to slide these out. But sometimes I pull more out, they get all over the place and I don't know which one, you know, if they're between 120 and 130s, like they basically look the same. So I don't know which is the right size. I need like something to like, like a, like a magazine and a gun to, to have it spring loaded. And, and I just go, you know, click that in. And then every time I pull one, it just kind of ejects one out, maybe pulls one out just a little bit. That. Someone someone make that and make a million dollars and just give me like partial credit for it. So I'm sure we have some some uh, some inventors out there. Make it happen, folks. In the name of Jaspies, turn of the century. Jeremy Nichols is our next autograph out of 149. We got Rodney Adams to 149. Janu uh, Smith to 149, Titans. We've got Jeremy Hill to 15 for the Bengals, nice. Tom Brady, he's fired up at a 299. And Pen Pals, Jamal Williams for the Packers, nice. Adam Kupperman with the Pack. Sure, that'd be great, Michael. I'll take 5% of sales. Off the gross, of course.
Marlon Humphrey, four ninety nine. So we got our two autographs already. We should have one more relic in here, plus number of numbered cards like Nathan Peterman to twenty five for the Bills. Fired up, Ray Lewis. What time is it? Game time. Eight out of forty nine. Any breakers in the house? Woo 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 woo. Woo! He's a fired up right now. Woo! What time is it? Game time! Right? Any breakers in the house? Woo, 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 woo. He's fired up. I'm fired up. Are you fired up? I'm fired up. Family ties. It'll be a randomizer. There's too many randomizers there. Odell Beckham Jr. to 87. Jeremy McNichols to 499. And the last bit here. Uh, Mac Hollins to 149. Eagles. And my boy Derek Carr. Elite coverage. Dual relic for the Raiders. That goes to Ziggy with the Raiders. Nice. I had to add gross in there, Michael House. I know how these deals work. <laughs> All right. Almost done, boys and girls. Almost done. We still haven't completed our Rogers yet. We're trying to get there. We've got three more boxes to complete that Rogers. Hopefully, we'll make it. Good luck, everyone. Now, I don't know what we're going to do after this. We got some orders coming in here. No, sir, Joe P. That is Monday through Friday. Ten buck breaks Monday through Friday. So check back on Monday. We've got plenty of breaks available on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We've got Flawless back on the site, ladies and gentlemen. Jazbeeshobbyland.com has Flawless. So check that out. Hopefully we'll be able to do that today. I'm sure another gold standard football is close to filling up. We had one that was almost in single digits when we started this break a little while ago. Jaspieshobbyland.com. Joe P. not pleased about the no $10 breaks. Well, sorry, man. You should have paid attention to when we go on air. You should have paid attention to when the schedule was. Not much, man. Hey, just hanging out, Joe P. we grinding through this uh, elite break, pulling some nice stuff, trying to make, trying to make a rock, trying to build a set while we while we do this break because we've got time for that I'm just knocking out the saturday and seeing what we can do yeah next week everybody 10 bucks breaks will be back next week i think uh nick jaspie will be doing monday wednesday friday and i believe jason jaspie will be doing tuesdays and thursdays and nothing changes for me i'm here tuesday through saturday doing the normal thing and jason jaspie will be doing hockey on monday wednesday and friday at least that's that's just a temporary schedule. Um, eventually, we'll have one person doing the ten buck break channels, uh, probably five nights a week or something like that. And then Jason Jaspi, once hockey starts getting a lot busier in the fall, winter, and early spring, spring even in summer, almost the summer, um, Jason Jaspi will be doing the hockey channel all the nights that he's here, and I'll still be here doing my thing, doing my thing. We'll have a really fun football season to go through, too. All these random rookies that we're seeing right here, we're going to find out which ones are going to be the hot commodity, you know? It was Odell Beckham Jr. a few years ago. He was pretty hot. You know, then it was Mariota and Winston. You know, Wentz, Dak Prescott, Zeke Elliott last year. Those are some of the big ones. Tyreek Hill in the midseason, so... There'll be a lot of fun things to get into. Out of 299. Fired up Cam Newton to 99. Uh, Patrick Mahomes to 499. Is it Spider Man? Yeah, I'm still on. Oh, it is Spider Man. I'm, I'm still on FXX. And Jeremy McNichols. Pen Pals on card autograph. For the Buccaneers, Kyle F. with that one. Nice. Deshaun Watson. 
Uh, Jared Davis to 25 for the Lions. Jonathan Stewart to 149, Panthers. And more Panthers. I've heard of this guy, Christian McCaffrey, 82 out of 99. Goes to the Panthers. That's Alex Lepore who also got this spot from a spot randomizer. Spot random mojo. That's going to become a thing, I think. Spot random mojo, 82 out of 99. Christian McCaffrey, that's one of the big names. Oh, we got a W in brown. I think we're still a few letters away. Malik Hooker to 71. Should be a relic. Oh, there's the relic. Dak Prescott. Dual relic. Going to the boys. That would be for Joe Kroll. All right, so another nice nice Christian McCaffrey to 99. 82 and 99. 99. That's it for the hits in this box. Let's see if we can get some uh, other low numbers or maybe some more letters. I love that spell balance. There's Melvin Gordon, 99, for the Los Angeles Chargers. Here's Frank Gordon, 99, for the Colts. Letters, 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 letters. Ryan Switzer to 499. No more letters? No more letters. Derrick Henry to 149. No more letters. We're trying to fit, finish that set. All right, two boxes to go, folks. In fact, I'll, I'll open both of the last boxes now that I have some space on the table. I'll open up, open both, and then we'll go. Kevin Crouch, last two, feeling a train whistle coming. Yeah, there has not been a train whistle in here yet. Casey looking for that Andrew Luck autograph in this box. Yeah, I feel like we haven't we haven't seen like a big no, I don't think it's guaranteed or anything like that, but I don't think we've seen like a big sort of veteran autograph in here, right? If, I don't I actually don't remember. So maybe we're we're due. I mean, he's on he's on the cover for Pete's sake, right? got to be there somewhere. All righty. Let's set that over here. Let's open up one more box. And we'll fly through the last boxes, then we'll do a couple randomizers, and then we'll be done with the break, and then we'll be going from there. I see some orders coming in. I see orders from Kevin Smith, from Chris, from Ed, Riley Card Collector, Matt, and Juan. Oh, that guy in the Saints, right, right. That was the older autograph there. Um, so... I see some orders coming in. Now remember, the 10 buck channel is not back until Monday. So if you're waiting on that, that's not gonna happen here. It's gonna happen on Monday. They broadcast Monday through Friday on the special 10 buck breaks channel on YouTube. Go search for that, go subscribe to it so you know exactly when they go on air. For us, uh, we can do everything else that's available on jazbeeshobbyland.com. The non 10 buck breaks on jazbeeshobbyland.com we can do. So we're about, I mean, we're pretty much close to finishing up. So. I would go ahead, visit the website right now, especially if you're not in this break. You don't really have to pay attention to it. Just go on, to, just go to the website, check it out, and um, start getting some other breaks going. Gold standard football. Uh, we've got flawless football on the site. We've got more, um, uh, what you call it, uh, stadium club baseball available on the website. 
We even have some Spectra basketball and Donner's Optic basketball that we can finish off as well. The Optic basketball on jazbeeshobbyland.com is the last third of the case, the final break, and the Spectra basketball is the last half of that case. We can do that. We got a full case break of gold standard football available as well, a full case random team break. Now, I know a lot of people have claimed that they would rather do random team breaks. Well, if that's the case, buy your spots, help us out, go for it. And we can fill that up tonight too. Gold standard random teams. If we did a gold standard random team and the flawless break, and that's all we did, I would, I would call that a good day. Now, if you wanna do more than that, by all means, we can do a lot more than that as well. We've got plenty of time tonight. Okay, so the final two boxes. Good luck, everybody. We got Travis Kelsey to 24, die cut. That's for the Chiefs. We got Ezekiel Elliott T. I don't think we're going to be able to finish off Ezekiel Elliott's name. Uh, Malachi Dupree, 36 out of 99 for the Green Bay Packers. That's for Adam Kupperman. We'll plop the hits back there. There's Ryan Switzer to 99. Tidal Waves, Tom Brady. Those are not numbered. And there is Kareem Hunt for the Chiefs. That was one of the last teams picked up. Uh, that goes to Brendan, I think. Yeah, Brendan. There you go, Brendan. Towards the end, second to last box. On card auto, Kareem Hunt. Steve Smith Sr. fired up to 299 for the Ravens. College ties. Zach Ertz to 99. Russell Wilson to 149. And a blank card. Plenty of blank cards for me now. For me to autograph. For me to sketch on. Uh, Ryan Tannehill to 149. And, hey, new Raider. Still a Seahawk in this break. So this will go to Dan Harris, but a Raider now. Marshawn Lynch. Deshaun Kaiser to 24, die cut for the Browns. Tim Williams for the Ravens out of 499. Fired up Jarvis Landry to 49. Oh, Christian McCaffrey again to four ninety nine. Corey Davis, nice to four ninety nine. Titans. All right, those are your hits here, and the last box. Good luck, everybody. Are we going to be able to finish that off? There's Chris Godwin, 007 out of 149. 007. Do, 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 Buccaneers, Kyle, who got the Buccaneers in a spot random. Spot random mojo. Pen Pals autograph coming up. Jordan Reed to 149. Tidal waves. And it's Mac Hollins is your last autograph. That goes to the Fly Eagles Fly. J uh, Joe Kroll with the Eagles. There you go, Joe. And now we're looking for a relic, and we're looking for anything uh, low number. J.O. Cheeson to 99. Terrell Pryor Sr. to 11 for the uh, Redskins. Field Vision, Adam Vinatieri to 25. Family Ties, 82 out of 299. More Family Ties to 99. Peyton Manning, Eli Manning. Chasing again to four ninety nine. We got DeAndre Hopkins to twenty four die cut. Deonta Foreman out of four ninety nine Texans. K for we already have the K for Odell Beckham Jr. We're looking for Aaron Rodgers, is to be honest with you. That's the closest. Desmond King to sixty four. And the last bit right here. Marlon Humphrey to four ninety nine. 
Ravens. Malachi Dupree to 85 for the Packers. And another Larry Fitzgerald Pro Bowl standout relic for Tyler Kish. Nice. And the last bits right here. And that's it, folks. There, we made it. Elite, pick your team number two. Full 12-box case break in the books. Jaspieshobbyland.com. Believe it or not, there it's a long break, but there are some nice hits in here, ladies and gentlemen. So we have another case available on jaspieshobbyland.com. So please, get your teams there. Get one going. Let's make the next one happen. Elite, pick your team three on jaspieshobbyland.com. Now we have a number of randomizers to do, so we're going to keep the video running. And we're going to sleeve all of the uh, cards in question up. Top load them as well. I might as well just top load them as well. And then we'll do a quick randomizer to see who gets what. So we're going to do it live. We're not going to set anything up. Our broadcasting software, for an odd reason, does not have a pause button. So that's why trade windows have been shorter. <laughs> Which, no one really trades anyway, so that's alright. But trade windows have been shorter. And there's more just extra blab time. <laughs> Right here. Oh, right. Thank you, Kevin. Oh, man. That could have been a disaster. I totally forgot the Father's Day packs. I definitely forgot Kevin Crouch. But shout out to him. Big ups to him. Propers for him for reminding me. All right. So in this elite football break, um, 2017 Panini Father's Day silver packs. But this is the special football edition right here. Top 10 people in a randomizer will be able to get that. Okay. So we got that. Let's set up the randomizers. Okay, so let's go back to the team list really quick. So from Tyler all the way down to Ziggy, that's the list right there. And then we'll use this randomizer list right here for all of the um, for all of the, whatchamacallits, all the other cards that we have to randomize. It's going to be kind of a lot. Actually get a... Oh, Michael Robertson, what's going on? Has been a while. Hello. You have a uh, post-it next to me so I can write down all of the hits. Do I have a pen around here somewhere? I don't. use this. All right, here we go. I'm just going to rock through these. All right, so for all the randomizers, it's going to be nine times for everything. Uh, let's do these left and right cards first. So these college ties cards don't have are not numbered, so we're just going to go left and right on those. So every dice roll will be Nine times, left, right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So the right side will get those. All right, so for all of those college ties cards, they'll go to the right side. Now, next one, we're just going to rock through these one by one. Face to face, Cowboys, Redskins, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Redskins, so that Des Bryant, Josh Norman one to 99 after nine times. Redskins. Uh, the family ties right here. The pounces out of two ninety nine. Need a blank list. There we go. Let's 
Steelers, Dolphins nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight, and nine. Steelers with that one. Steelers get that one. That's out of 299. Next one is the face to face. Uh, a AP and Urlacher out of 299. Vikings and Bears. Nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Bears. Bear down. Next one is the Pounces again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Steelers. Steelers with that one. Let's go back here. This one is face to face out of 299. Deion Sanders, Jerry Rice. Cowboys edition, 49ers edition, nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Niners with that one. Staying in the Bay, San Francisco. With that, next one, family ties, uh, the the Kelseys. I didn't realize that there that that was a thing. Yeah, Travis Kelsey and Jason Kelsey. There you go. Had no idea. KC, Philadelphia. It's a little bit easier now. One, instead of typing out all the teams. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Uh, stays with the Fly Eagles Fly. So Philadelphia, you'll get that one. Joe Kroll with the Kelsey brothers. Um, there's the Matthewses. That, that I knew, I think. That ref definitely refreshed my memory, but that I think I knew, that, the, that Jake Matthews and Clay Matthews. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Sticks with Green Bay, so Adam Kupperman with the Packers. That's a purple one. Is That must be lower numbered, right? Yeah, to 49. There you go. Uh, the Kelseys again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Nope, that's still eight times. Boy, nine times, six and a three. Philadelphia with that one. The last one of these family ties, Peyton and Eli. That is 39 out of 99. And that is Indianapolis, New York football giants. Nine times, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. That goes to the New York football giants. So, so Eli beating out his brother right there. And Father's Day packs. Top 10 get a pack each. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and good luck everybody. Ninth and final time. Top 10 after nine times, Joe Kroll, Brendan, Dave, Ziggy, Dakota, James, Tyler, Joe, Greg, and Riley Card Collector. You are in the top 10. And that is it, folks. That was Elite Football from 2017. Pick your team number two. Full 12 box case break from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Nice to do this one on a Saturday. Thank you very much. We will see you next time. There's another case on the site. Let's do it. jazbeeshobbyland.com. Bye-bye.